Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to add dropshipping products to your Wix store. Very simple and easy to do, but before we get started, I'm just gonna remind you guys I do have a full Wix playlist showing you guys a bunch of tutorials and tips on how to use Wix. So if that interests you, the link will be in the comment section as well as in the description. But anyways, let's get right into this video and I'll be showing you guys how to add those dropshipping products. So now once you're on your Wix page here, it's like as you guys see I am here, you just wanna first make sure that you have a store on your Wix page. And to add one, if you don't have one, you just wanna go up to the add section up here click on apps and then you will see uh, the online store option here just click on add on it and then it will add it to your store uh, but then once you're done that you want to make sure you're on the classic wix editor so i'm just going to scroll down to the bottom here and just go on to go to editor and then switch to editor just so it puts me over to the edit page on wix and once we are on the editor here as you guys see with the right and left side i have all these different icons here so now you just want to click on add apps at the left side here and then once this opens up we're just going to search for drop shipping and then it will show us the dropshipping apps that uh, they have on Wix. And one that I really like using is called Spocket here. It's very, very good for shipping stuff out of the US and EU and not from China. So it's a lot quicker shipping if you're looking for that. Uh, but anyways, you just wanna click on Spocket. It's one I'm gonna show you guys today. And then you wanna click on Add to Site. This is gonna pop this open here. So we're just gonna want to read this info really quickly. Just go through this stuff. And then click on Allow and Add. And then you just wanna click on go to dashboard and then it will bring us over to the Spocket dashboard. Now we can just scroll through the Spocket website and check out what stuff is on here. Uh, one thing I recommend that you guys could do as well is you guys could sort by shipping time if you're looking for that. Uh, Cause one thing I will point out, the shipping time here is a lot less on a lot of items just because they ship out of the United States as well as Europe. So as you guys see here, one to three days on this item, one to three days on this item. So it is very, very fast shipping. Uh, now, one thing I'd like to point out too, that these uh, items do usually send samples. Uh, so right here, as you see, I clicked on this item here and you can click on order samples if you'd like to. They just added that in just so you could check out some stuff. Also take some pictures for your products yourself, just so your page looks a lot more professional. But if you just click on order samples, you'll be able to select the variation of the product as well as the quantity. And you just leave notes to the supplier as well. Uh, so there is lots of customizability with this uh, app as well. It works really, really great for drop shipping stuff. Uh, but there is tons of things on here. You could just search for stuff at the top as well as some categories and supplier and stuff like that once you get used to a supplier and as well by location and where it ships to. So there's a lot of stuff you can do on here. But all you have to do is look through here, find some stuff that works for you. And then all you want to do when you find some stuff is you want to add it to your import list. And I would like to point out that you will have to purchase the package for this as well. Uh, it works really, really well though, as your customers will uh, like to keep buying from you due to your shipping alone, because sometimes drop shipping through China is very, very slow. Uh, but if you look through here and pick a plan that works for you, most of you will probably start on the starter plan over here to the left, uh, just because you won't be moving a lot of product. It's not really worth you paying more for the higher plans as of right away. Uh, but yeah, so all you have to do is click on a plan that you would like to, and then you'll be able to start adding stuff to your import list and importing it to your site. Uh, anyhow, I I really hope I was able to help you guys out with showing you guys how to add drop shipping products to your Wix store. If this was helpful to you, be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.